Well, the sounds of the season starting tomorrow, you can expect to see start seeing and hearing the Salvation Kettlebell Ringers at local participating businesses. Now, I got to speak with one longtime ringer about why he gets involved year after year. 84-year-old Harold Pierce has been ringing bells for the Salvation Army for 19 years, and he still gets this excited. It's Christmas bell ringing season! A season to sport a Santa hat and share a song in his heart. With candy canes and silver lanes ago. A number of people tell me that when they drive up in the parking lot and they hear the bell and hear me singing, it changes the whole day. And that makes me feel good. For Pierce, the decision to become a bell ringer did not happen overnight. The money, of course, will help the Salvation Army continue its work helping the hungry and homeless. Major Keith Biggers says the work does so much more. The silver bells, uh, that song was written based on the Salvation Army uh, uh, bell ringing. And uh, so it is so iconic and people say, hey, it's good to see that uh, the kettles are out and the bells are ringing and it reminds them of... Uh, 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 there is no greater need than, than, than we have presently. Bigger says volunteers are still needed, and the way to sign up is by going to registertoring.com. Pierce can't recommend it enough. Look, first of all, if you are a people person, then this is the perfect job for you because you get a chance to put smiles on people's faces. And there's nothing in the world like it. The final bells will ring Christmas Eve, ringing the bells of the season and bringing joy to those around you. Ashley Harding, Channel 4, The Local Station. I just have to say I love Harold all over again. He's so sweet. <laughs> well, the Salvation Army is hoping to raise $250,000 this year, and that money is going to go toward a free Christmas dinner for people who need it the most and other supplies for food pantries and disaster relief. For more information on how to volunteer, go to our website, newsforjax.com.